And staying in Asia, Japan appears to be moving closer to releasing the first batch of underground uh, water from the Fukushima nuclear plant. Paul, should we be concerned? Well, the rising risk of radiation is also a concern, but the Tokyo Electric Power Corporation that runs the nuclear plant says no. It says a conclusion was reached after the groundwater passed detailed safety tests. A joint analysis with other Japanese energy and chemical agencies also found that levels of radioactive isotopes in the water, such as cesium-137, were well below safety thresholds. According to Japan's national broadcaster NHK, the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant could release some 560 tons of groundwater into the Pacific Ocean as early as May 21st. The American ambassador to Japan, Caroline Kennedy, visited the crippled power plant on Wednesday, pledging U.S. support for the nuclear cleanup. Uh, the United States has always uh, done all we can to support the people of Japan as they face these very, very uh, tragic disasters and have uh, made great progress in um, recovering and we stand ready to help in any way we can going forward um, uh, in the future. The Fukushima Daiichi station suffered a triple meltdown in March 2011 when the country was rocked by an earthquake and tsunami. It's considered the worst nuclear disaster since Chernobyl in 1986.